Hi YouTubers, this is Lonnie Clark and uh, I am going to show you what I do because I think we all need to get involved and do this every single day. This is my little file that I made that I keep up on my desk and I call, this is, I printed out all of the congressman's phone numbers and I printed out all of the senator's phone numbers and you can call them and you can do the same and see right here that's my senator Ron Whiten Jeff Merkley I've highlighted a few of them these are my regulars that I call where is she Barbara Boxer oh, I don't think I I don't think I highlighted Barbara Boxer but I'm gonna be giving her a call this morning and I thought what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tape record me calling them to show you this is what how simple it is that's Ron Wyden's office so let's see what Ron Wyden's office has to say to us right now uh, hi my name is Lonnie Clark and I live in Eugene Oregon and I'm calling about the nuclear ener energy industry um, you know we know about the ongoing catastrophe in Fukushima and that is completely out of control we know about Hanford in the last three days we have heard about three uranium plants having catastrophic events one this morning is in Missouri one's in Australia one's in, in Africa and one's in Missouri this week we also had two near misses of nuclear meltdowns in, or problems one was in New Jersey and one we don't know what the story is going on in Arkansas so <clears throat> I'm calling my senator to ask him to do what he can do shut down the nuclear power industry we need to get the NRC to really be an oversight place and we need them to be, have, be, have honest conversations and we need to shut down all the nuclear energy industries and we need to focus our scientific money on neutralizing the catastrophe that nuclear power has already done to our our country my zip code is 97404 Alrighty, thank you. Bye bye. So that was my first call to Ron Widens. The guy said, absolutely, he'll let him know and he'll pass my comments on. Okay, so now I'm going to actually call Jeff Merkley, which I think is hysterical because Jeff Merkley is a big proponent of anti GMO salmon. Uh, what's the point of non-GMO salmon if it's all full of nuclear? That's kind of my thing. This phone's ringing right now. Uh, so I'm getting a message machine. There's nobody there. So, I'm going to leave him a message. So, he's encouraging us to send him an email, merkley.senate.gov. Hi, Senator Merkley. This is Lonnie Clark. I live in Eugene, Oregon, and I'm calling you and urging you to do what you can to shut down all nuclear power plants in the United States and in fact stop funding nuclear altogether. Uh, this week we've had three massive explosions, major problems. We had a uranium explosion, a uranium mine explosion in Australia, one in Africa, and this morning the news was, guess what, there's huge leaks at a uranium plant in St. Louis, Missouri. Now we have Hanford, we have Fukushima, we now have these uranium plants, we have Sellafield in the UK, we have had dozens of near misses in our country. We no longer need nuclear power plants because the United States has as many nuclear weapons as they could ever dream of getting. And it is an outrage that our government continues to fund anything related to nuclear. We need to force our scientific money not into developing nuclear, not into developing nuclear science for medicine. We need to develop nuclear science into neutralizing the catastrophes that they've already caused. 
And I think it's frankly ridiculous that you're out there touting anti-GMO sentiments for the salmon when you're doing nothing about Hanford. What good are GMO-free sa salmon from the Columbia River when it's all full of plutonium and strontium from Hanford? It's ridiculous. So I hope you really take this message seriously and will take action. And I appreciate all the work that you do. Thank you. Goodbye. So that was me calling Jeff Merkley. So next on the list is Barbara Boxer. There's 10 seconds of recording time left. Uh oh. Please record your message at the tone. Senator Merkley, this is Lonnie Clark. I'm calling from Eugene, Oregon, and I am calling you and encouraging you to do all you can to stop funding nuclear power and to move to shut down all nuclear power plants and do what we can. We no longer need nuclear energy. The United States has enough nuclear weapons to kill the world a billion times over. And frankly, I think it's ridiculous that you're out there working against GMOs in the Columbia River, Columbia, the GMO salmon, when the Columbia River is full of plutonium and strontium from Hanford. Go ahead and eat that salmon. See how quickly you get cancer. Uh, you know, I don't mean to be disrespectful, but frankly, the whole nuclear energy industry is disrespectful to all of human life on our planet. And I hope that you will work to shut down nuclear power as fast as possible. This week, we've had three major catastrophes with uranium mining. Uh, the news this morning was that there was a uranium mine in St. Louis, Missouri, where catastrophic leaks have been found. The, I'm sure you've heard about the uranium mine blowing up in Australia and the one having problems in Africa. This week alone, there was New Jersey and Arkansas that had serious problems with their nuclear power plants. The NRC does nothing but rubber stamp every catastrophic piece of neglect that the nuclear industry does. And it is about time that our tax dollars set about working for the American public and we need to stop nuclear power now. My zip code is 97404 and I appreciate all the work you're doing. However, I think it's a bit ridiculous for you to be behind an anti-GMO movement when you're not behind the anti-nuclear movement. I appreciate all your work that you're doing, and hopefully you'll start moving in this direction. Thank you. Okay, I had to rewind it because guess what? We were being recorded, and they heard us. So you can see how my, if you decide to change your message, if you decide to erase and a re erase, and guess what? I think actually my message didn't go through to him, to Jeff Merkley, even after that second time. You know why? because I didn't hit the pound button. I've discovered that if you call your elected officials and you leave your message and you don't talk to a person directly and you don't hit the pound button, it doesn't go through. So you know what that means? I have to do it again. I'm going to do it again for good measure. So I am going to make you suffer through this because this is what it's like, folks. Let's hit the redial button. Oh, crap. I have to do it again. So, let me call him. Mr. Merkley, 3753. Jeff Merkley's number, 202-224-3753. Ron Wyden, 202-224-5244. Barbara Boxer, 202-224-3553. Harry Reid, he's worthless. Uh, there's Jeff Merkley again. That means nobody's there. He's for sure not in his office. Harry Reid, 202-224-3542. Please leave a message after the beep and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Or you can contact me via my website at merkley.senate.gov. Thank you, and have a great day. Senator Merkley, this is Lonnie Clark from Eugene, Oregon again, and I am not sure if my last message actually got sent because I forgot to hit the pound button. But I am calling you with an urgent message to do all you can to please stop the nuclear power industry. 
we actually need to stop funding nuclear. We need to force scientific money into neutralizing the ca catastrophic damage that it is causing us already. This week alone, we've had three uranium mine catastrophes, one in Australia, one in Africa. This morning's news was in St. Louis, Missouri. Yesterday, the news was that there was a fire in Arkansas, and there was a fire, there was a problem in a New Jersey plant. We have Hanford, we have Fukushima. The, it, the ca catastrophic events that are going on around, situated around the nuclear power industry is unfathomable. And I am dumbfounded that my elected officials do not take it seriously and are not doing everything they can to stop it. Frankly, I think it's ridiculous that you're out there touting that you're anti-GMO salmon when you're doing nothing about Hanford. Every salmon that comes through the Columbia River is going to be full of plutonium and strontium because of Hanford. And we're doing nothing. And in fact, Hanford is threatening the drinking water of Seattle within the next 10 years because of Bechtel. Illegally poured uh, contaminated toxins in 40 mile trenches up there. They were suppo They were ordered by the government to line the trenches and they just dug the trenches and dumped it in without lining it. Now, I don't know about you, but that is probably the biggest catastrophe I've ever heard of. Senator Merkley, I appreciate all the work that you do. However, I think that really one of the things you really must do is get actively involved in shutting down all nuclear. Okay, so what I did just now, YouTubers, was I marked the message urgent, even though the machine cut me off in my last bit. I think he got the tenor of it. So um, I'm going to post this up. I'm not going to call Barbara Boxer's office. I am going to call them, but I won't show that to you here. I won't force you to listen to all of that again. But this is how it's done. And I would suggest that you do what I did, and that is make yourself a little file. And call these rat bastards every single day ma'am we need to get people if if we could get 500,000 people calling our elected officials every day or twice a week or once a week I guarantee you nuclear would be shut down within two years I mean it may be shut down anyways in two years because the whole freaking industry is falling apart but youtubers I, you know I'm coming to the YouTube because they're our last our last chance I don't know. I am actually feeling like this. So, talk to you later, you guys. Bye.